I'm going to the Crate and Barrel wedding registry right now. Ta -da! Apparently it's pretty cool, so let's check it out. So it's before the mall opens, which is kind of nice. These are so pretty. I need it. And there's more Crate and Barrel. I mean, you guys can look up what they have basically. So, but they gave you a little booklet. It's pretty useful. Funny story, Alex's grandma did buy us this. We ended up returning it and getting our steak knives and stuff. I really like these ceramic plates. And the cool thing is they just also got the melamine ones, which is basically like plastic. So it's not gonna like crack or anything like that. If like kids, for example, use it or if you take it outside and stuff like that. So that's cool. I like it. And you're not gonna compromise your aesthetic for it, you know? And you get to use some of the knives and like chop stuff. Okay, it's very sharp. <laughs> and then once you're done, they'll give you like a small little bag as a thank you. We'll see what's in it. Okay guys, I just got back from the Crate and Barrel wedding registry event. So let's look at what's inside the tote. There isn't much, but I did put the booklet back in here and it was um, pretty cool because um, it'll just tell you what it does and stuff like that and then you can do like a little planner right here where like you can write how many people you're expecting is there going to be like a bridal shower engagement party and stuff like that and then there's like a little um, calculator for how many gifts you should probably have in your um, registry they're recommended to have extra presents um, just because a lot of the times people will buy a few and then it just runs out of things to buy and um they were like yeah i don't know it was overall pretty cool and they're like oh yeah sometimes some grandmas and stuff like that will be extra generous and they'll want to get you like a 200 dollars gift and stuff like that and i was like funny because huh? <laughs> i don't know i thought that was the norm but apparently it isn't um and then so the one thing that's in here okay a little peek at their wish list. I don't know what this is. Um, I guess you can write down your name and like include this inside your wedding invitation or something, just so people know you're a crate and barrel like register. No idea. It looks like a sticky note, but it's not, and it has all the same things. And it has a cute little um, handwritten note that says, "Thank you for coming to our registry event." as a tag and guess what this is it's pretty exciting especially since it's free um i mean granted they're not that expensive but i mean it's so cool you can never have enough of these little sunless wine glasses and in fact i'm pretty sure i'm drinking out of one right now so hey two more for me yay <laughs> so there you go um, so this is what all was inside the wedding registry and then when we got there they actually like served us some like lattes and like a couple of coffees from the Breville like coffee makers that they were obviously like kind of demonstrating. They also had like cute little muffins that they made um, that morning with the, I don't know, little the Dutch oven thing. Not Dutch oven, what is it called? Conventional one. <laughs> I don't know, like the one with the French doors, you know. Um, yeah, there weren't a lot of couples. There's probably five other couples. All of them came with their like fiancés, and I was alone because Alex is working today, which is fine because we were already married. I don't know. Don't sue me, Curtain Barrel. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. It was pretty cool. I would definitely recommend checking it out. I found a lot of cool stuff uh, while I was shopping around, and I actually did create like a real wedding registry. So if you guys want to buy me something, you can. I'll include the link down below, and you guys can check it out. So um, all in all, if you're planning on getting married, I would definitely recommend doing it. It's like something fun. You get to like look around things, think about like what you want to upgrade or like how you can style different things and stuff like that around your house um and i don't know it's just a cute little like 
shopping experience, I think. So yeah, thank you for watching. Uh, let me know what you thought and if you'd like to attend one too, or if you do end up attending one, I guess. Thanks for coming. Bye. <laughs>